I'm going to show you how to unlock your bootloader, install custom recovery, root, and install a custom ROM on the LG Styler 2 Plus. This will erase all your data. First, you want to unlock developer options by going to your settings, general, about phone, software info, and keep tapping build number until you are a developer. Go back twice to developer options and turn on OEM unlock and USB debugging. Next, you want to install ADB tools and extract it onto your computer. In the file you extracted ADB tools to, hold shift and right click. in the folder and open command window here. Plug your phone into your computer. In the command window type in ADB space reboot space bootloader and hit enter. Your phone will come up with this screen. Hit always allow from this computer and OK. Type in ADB reboot bootloader and hit enter again. You will come up with this screen. Next type in Fast boot space OEM space unlock and hit enter. After that's done, type in fast boot space reboot. dash bootloader and hit enter next type in fast boot reboot hit enter you'll come up with this screen hit the power key Next we are going to install the custom recovery image. In the command window we are going to type in ADB space reboot space bootloader and hit enter. you will get this screen on your phone again. We are going to now type in fast boot space flash space recovery space the directory to where your image file is. Mine is C double dot 
forward slash users forward slash griff zero three forward slash desktop forward slash LG space stylo space two forward slash TW RP dash three point two point zero dash zero PH two N dot image which is IMG. Next, we are going to unplug the phone from the computer and remove the battery. Put the battery back in your phone. Hold volume down and power buttons at the same time. When you see this image, let go of power and then re-hold power. Do not let go of the volume down button. You will see this screen. Use volume down key and up key to change. Highlight yes. Press power. Highlight yes again. Press power again. Press power again. Your phone will go into recovery mode. Wait for it to load. When it says enter password, hit cancel. Then swipe to allow modifications. You should have this screen now. Plug your phone back into your computer. On your phone, go to wipe. and format data. Type yes and then check mark. Your phone will reformat now. You will get this screen. Go back until you see this screen again. Hit reboot. Recovery. Do not install. Hit the power button. And wait for your, your phone to reload. Swipe to allow modifications. Go to mount. And make sure MTP is enabled. Go back to this screen. Next, you want to transfer your NoVerify opt encrypt zip file and your SuperSU zip file. Once copied to the internal storage of your phone, we can continue. Disconnect your phone from your computer. Tap on install. No verify opt encrypt. Swipe to confirm flash. Next go back and do the same with update super sue swipe to confirm flash reboot your phone 
and do not install power key to continue once your phone is rebooted you must set it up and unlock developer options again by going to settings general about phone software info and keep tapping build number open developer options and make sure USB debugging is turned on reconnect your phone to your computer make sure your phone is set under file transfer always allow from this computer next on your computer go back to your command window and type in ADB space reboot space recovery and hit enter hit the power button on your phone you will go back into recovery mode swipe to allow modifications next we are going to go to wipe Swipe to factory reset. Go back. Back again. Transfer the custom ROM to your phone. Next, go to install. And select your ROM. Swipe to confirm flash. Once flashing is complete, hit wipe cache Dalvik. Swipe to wipe. Go back. 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 Reboot. Recovery. Do not install. Hit the power button. Now reboot system. Do not install. Hit the power button to boot your phone up for the first time. Set up your phone for the first time. Once your phone is loaded, it will look like this. Now we are going to root the phone. You go to about phone and unlock developer options by tapping build number and turning on Android debugging. Also go to your USB charging transfer files. Always allow from this computer then type in your command window adb reboot recovery in my command window to reboot my phone into recovery we are going to transfer the super Sue file to the phone again and then we're going to install it and swipe to install
now we are going to go back and install gaps make sure you have put that on your phone as well once gaps is done installing your phone is now got custom ROM on it and it is rooted enjoy